Hello, 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 and welcome to another Rangaroos unit of the week. And today we are taking a look at the SU-100. So the SU-100 was a World War II tank destroyer used during the later years of World War II by the Soviet Army. It was based off the SU-85, the SU-1 just having a 100mm gun, while the SU-85 only had an 85mm gun. And this tank destroyer was an absolute devastator against the Germans due to the fact its gun could actually penetrate the enemy tigers and panthers and heck, probably even the king tigers as well. So an absolutely great tank destroyer used during World War II and still being used in some countries as we see it's being used by China today. So in game it's a 15 point Chinese unit. It is a year to 1969 so you can use in any category type deck and it type restricts into mechanized, armored and support. Now, if we take a look at its first weapon, we have the D10T, 100mm gun, has 45 of these rounds with a range of ground of 1900 meters, a pretty good accuracy of 45%, an AP power of 11, HE power of 3, and a rate of fire of 7 rounds a minute. Pretty good gun for 15 points. It has a very good accuracy of 45% for 15 points. The AP power is also quite nice. You can penetrate lightly armored tanks, APCs quite easily. And even with free HG power, it's a pretty good anti-infantry gun for shooting infantry inside of buildings, like an assault gun, like it was meant to be used. And if you take a look at its miscellaneous stats, it is no machine gun for the SU-100. It's got three frontal armor, Two side, two back, and one top. So not an awful lot of armor, but still it's not too bad. 15 points. It's got a medium size, bad optics, pretty low speed of 50 kilometers an hour, poor stealth, and an okay autonomy of 320 kilometers. In battle, its tank is an absolutely blast to have in your deck. Thanks to its cheap price and good gun, it makes a pretty good APC and light tank killer. And also, you can get a lot of them. Yeah, I think you can get like 20 of them on a card. Something around that. An awful, awful, awful lot. And you can just spam the everlasting crap out of them. To make sure it's cheap price. And they're also very good for killing infantry inside of buildings. Because it has that nice range and free HE power. You will easily plop them down to Kingdom Come if you can keep line of sight on the infantry. So overall, the SU-100 is an absolutely great tank destroyer. Uh, if you can field it in your deck, I'd highly recommend you should, because it's probably one of the best 10 to 15 point tanks you can get in game. And uh, yeah, that's all I have time for. This has been another Rangaroos unit of the week. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.